header. This uh, hard drive seems to have some weak sectors, 29 of them to be more precise. And in this video I will show you how to force the reallocation of them so you don't uh, uh, lose your data when it's being stored into sectors that it shouldn't be. So the first thing that you need to do is to start the command prompt, run as administrator, it will come up any moment now, and here you must be sure which one of the hard drives is the one that you uh, want to fix. But first, extremely, extremely, extremely important, you need to remove all your data from that hard drive, copy it to something else. That hard drive needs to be empty. As you can see, mine is fully empty. You cannot do this with data on the hard drive, so move the data. Okay, now once you are sure which one is the hard drive, in my case it's X, for you it could be any other letter, you, you start to format it and you need to enter the current uh, label of the hard drive, the volume label, and then simply press yes and it will start to format that hard drive and it will take a really, really, really long time. Uh, as you can see, at the moment, uh, this format is starting for this 3.84 terabyte hard drive. It's uh, 8.07 in the morning. And uh, when it kind of finishes, you will see that is about 17.57 uh, minutes. So this thing took a bunch of times, uh, of time, sorry about that. I don't know, eight hours or, or something like that to, to finish the formatting. Depending on the size of the drive could take even more or less if you are lucky. So, at this point, let's start the hard drive Sentinel and see what it tells us now. For the same drive, 51 bad sectors. So, this hard drive is actually worse than uh, we thought. It doesn't have only weak sectors. When it tested them more in depth while formatting, they are actually bad sectors and they are more. They are 51, not 29. So you could still try to use this drive. As you can see, this is a hard drive uh, that has been used for less than a year continuously and still has issues. This particular one is a surveillance hard drive used in a desktop environment, which is quite a bad use for it. And probably this is why uh, it's not working right. As you can see, we don't have any more current uh, pending sector count, but we have reallocation event errors which has spiked after the format. So it has uh, reallocated the weak sectors, but uh, found other uh, bad sectors, which is even worse. But at least uh, we know that this hard drive is not to be relied upon anymore. Now to have an even more uh, definitive answer, uh, we can actually uh, you can see here the temperatures of the hard drive whatnot we can actually do something else in this uh, particular program in hard drive sentinel to yeah close everything that could potentially try to write on that hard drive although they should have been closed before we will try to use a test again make sure you choose the correct hard drive which is x in my case do not choose anything else, you will wipe your data. And you need to reinitialize re disk surface. It's destructive, all data will be removed. And start, yes, yes. And at this particular point in time, uh, you kind of need to wait. And again, this will take an extreme amount of time, depending on the size of your drive. 
let's see exactly how much uh, this thing took in my situation yep almost 30 hours and it reallocated uh, a bunch of uh, sectors it has bad blocks it's mm, not good at all let's see the transfer speed as you can see there are some dips where the bad sectors are not extremely bad but i would not rely on this hard drive with any important data at this point and uh, yeah you can see the exact areas with problems on on this uh, particular map on, of the drive uh, and it will give us uh, in a moment an even more uh, severe warning let me just put that on the screen you can see 234 bad sectors so this has spiked even more after this in-depth uh, test of the hard drive so backup immediately i don't have anything else to backup from this drive it's already empty when i began all of these uh, things and it says it will probably fail within 46 days this thing would probably fail even faster than that so i will link in the description another video where i show you how to rma a hard drive that still has a manufacturing manufacturer warranty in my case it's from western digital and they basically sent me a good drive uh, in place of this failing one so that was quite lucky for me this was a drive with three years of warranty and i was in the last half of year or there was something like that but it was enough for a warranty